Morning, everybody. Uh, today, we're gonna go on our first snowy fat biking ride of the year. Laura's gonna be on the Muckluck. I'm gonna be riding the Otso, and we'll see how far we can get. You ready? Sure. <laughs> Better than just sitting around inside. <laughs> All right, let's get going. So the first challenge is just getting the fat bikes out. They're pretty uh, big and unwieldy, especially in our small place here. Oh, that bike looks extra supple there. It does. <laughs> Laura's on the muck luck. It's got a studded front, Jones bar. Are you riding? Sure. Okay. Here we go. So fat biking, when it's fresh, surprisingly hard. It's kind of like pedaling through sand. And all the branches are really low. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, my wheels just stopped. <laughs> Climbs pretty good. Yay! Something very regal about being so upright on here. <laughs> <laughs> and this is the Otso. I'm running the Revelate Nano Painters in the back just to hold layers. <laughs> it's almost easier to cut a new track. <laughs> Thank. This is like pedaling, pedaling through molasses. So. Fat bikes, as you can see, don't just uh, magically float <laughs> on fresh snow. <laughs> How'd you do? Good. Because it's like six, six inches deep, my pedal would like <laughs> go into the snow, the fresh powder, and I would lose my footing. How are the boots oh. so far, speaking of which? Oh, the boots are great. My feet are not warm, but they're not cold either. Mine are surprisingly toasty. These are the Bontrager. So I think what we're gonna do is Swap bikes just so we can see how the other bike rides. I'm curious to see how uh, Jones Bar fat bike rides. What do you think of it so far? Oh, I loved it actually. Yeah. It feels really stable. No, this is fun because you're like upright, <laughs> you know, driving a Cadillac yeah. <laughs> through the snow. Oh, this is definitely different. <laughs> a lot more upright. So the front end of the Mukla, uh, less twitchy, I would say, than the Otso. Whee! I think I actually really like how the Jones Bar feels on uh, the Muckluck here. Good leverage, uh, less weight on the front, just so that the front end has a little bit better chance of getting up and over snow, not just like plowing into it. <laughs> Yay. Yay! How was your first snowy fat bike ride? <laughs> a good workout. <laughs> yeah, uh, it was fun. It's uh, interesting to be out there before anybody else had really gone out there. Definitely a lot harder than you would expect, especially through the fresh stuff. So between the two bikes, I think the Muckluck more stable, yes. Otso more responsive. Yes, I think the Otso did better at just plowing through the fresh powder. Uh, and the pa that much fresh powder helped really dampen the steering. The Muckluck definitely needed to be in somebody else's wheel well. <laughs> Uh, both interesting bikes. I think we both preferred the studded front rear end, so I think I'm going to put a, a studded front tire on the Otso. Bontrager boots, doing pretty good. Toes still warm. How are you doing? My toes are cold. Toes are cold. <laughs> I, I think that's just the curse of being me. They're less cold than my regular <laughs> snow boots, so there's that. That's it for this video. If you want more snowy bike content, let us know in the comments below. Because there will be more snow. <laughs> yes, it'll be months of snowy bike content. Uh, if you like these vids, uh, consider supporting the channel. Uh, happy holidays, and until next time, keep the supple side down.